Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Um, so I just wanted to say a few things before we actually start the tutorial. Now today we're going to be uh, taking a look at uh, some of the ways to produce, well, one of the ways to produce power early game. And that is harnessing the power of geothermal energy. So, hold on, one sec, one sec. Okay. Um, so yeah, today I'm going to be showing you how to make a very cheap and simple uh, setup that will allow you to get tons of power early game. Okay, that will allow you to get tons of renewable, easy and cheap um, early game power before you get your first um, nuclear reactor and if you really don't want to use combustion engines or, or something like that. So start out by raising these one from the no, no. start out by making a three by three base and place down your geothermal electric generators on the outside. On the inside place any block you want. You can place a placeholder block if you if you want to. However, if not it's fine. Now Around the outside, put some coated red copper cables, or normal red copper cables, and extend them out a bit. And on the end, place energy storage block, or your energy grid that you need to supply. Then you're going to be needing, um, yeah, yeah, sorry, sorry. Then you're going to be needing to place, um, you know, you're going to need uh, to place one block higher to be able to contain the lava. You can go higher from there if you want. And you can stack this model multiple times to make more and more and more power. I'll be showing how to do that in a second. And for the basic setup, oh, by the way, put on your fire proximity helmet. <laughs> and fire proximity suit. And then just, you know, start filling this up with lava. Or if you want, you can just leave the middle block. And if we go over here, now you can see we're getting a bunch of power per second. And now, as I said, I'm going to show you how to stack this. So just build up a bit, I think... Yeah, it has to be a minimum of two blocks. Then place your geothermal electric generators again. Place down your, um, your block. Surround this, uh, well, contain it, basically. Uh, well, sorry. <laughs> On the outside, place your your um, your red copper cables, whatever type you want. Extend this and connect it to the main grid. Now make some um, yeah, make some more uh, containment. And once again, fill this up with lava. Now that we have stacked the setup, as you can see, we're getting a bunch of power. And you can stack this three times, or four times. Provided you have the resources, this could essentially be unlimited energy for you. So once again, two blocks, um, your geothermal electric generators. These aren't too expensive, they are four high-speed steel ingots, um, two copper panels, one coated red copper cable, and uh, two thermoelectric elements, which are made with steel plate, red copper wire, aluminium wire, and some quartz powder on the assembly machine. Build up one more. Place your, well, basically repeat the previous steps. Put some more um, coated red copper cables here. Oh well, I need to be one. Once again, contain the lava so that it doesn't spill out. Now fill this up with lava and connect this to the main grid. And now you'll see that we're getting a bunch more power. So you can cover this or you cannot cover this. If you cover it, as you see, uh, obsidian will start to form down here at the bottom. Don't worry, it's completely harmless and it won't affect your production at all. You can cover this up if you if you want, if you're interested. As you can see, it's a very simple setup. 
and it just requires any type of blocks and drills from all electric generators and some copper wires. And you can see that this is quite a lot of power. So yeah, that's the very, very, very basic setup. It's only 3x3 three three because that's kind of what you will need for early game. And because I really can't find any other ways to do it. <laughs> I, I was originally... Hold on, do I have my original design around here? That's my... That's my test. Yeah. So my original design uh, put the cables below. And I did record a video using this, but in the end I regretted it because look. All this obsidian formed on the bottom. And I was like, hell no. So instead, I thought of connecting them to the sides, which worked. So, yeah. Don't make the mistake of um, connecting them from the bottom, because otherwise they'll just get replaced by obsidian, and you'll, one, waste resources, and two, make your grid not as effective. So yeah, that's basically the entire thing. Uh, thank you so much for watching. This has been a, a very, very, very short video. I still hope you enjoyed it. If you're in early game, this is an absolute great idea to build. It is cheap, it is effective, and it will basically give you unlimited energy for whatever you need. Chemical plants, uh, assembly machines, um, oil derricks, whatever you need, presses, whatever you need will be covered by this. And well, if not, then you can just build more. <laughs> Now, before I go, I just want to give a quick thanks to um, Far North for being my second commenter on this channel. Thank you very much, buddy. I appreciate it. And, um, Joe, J O dot 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 K392 for commenting and for being my first ever commenter and for subscribing to the channel. And I'm going to continue doing this <laughs> until I just have so many that I can't keep track of. So thank you so much for watching, uh, remember to like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. Uh, I encourage you, if you have any more ideas that you, will, uh, that you want me to cover in the future, then feel free to leave them down in the comments. I'll be sure to check them out, they'll, they'll surely be super cool. And yeah, uh, that's it, that has been it for me, the chosen individual, and I'll see you next time. Peace out gamers! Yeah, this, no, no, I'm actually gonna go build this in my survival world. Oh, by the way, the story of this, um, the video's already over. You can already go to wherever you want. But see, it's using a lot of power per second. Um, uh, the story of this is that I was playing on a server with my friend. <laughs> and, well, we have an HBM like tech mod server. And we had just started out. And he showed me this thing called the Geothermal Electric Generators. And... Then he made a joke that I would post it on my channel saying how to get free uh, early game energy 100% real no fake And I was like, you know what? That's a good idea So I implemented it Anyways, yeah, thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Peace out